Well, you almost called me to lose my best friend. And what are you going to do with these things? What do you mean, what am I going to do with them? Well, you couldn't sell them to an undertaker. Now you ain't going to never get rid of them. Don't worry. They'll be gone by tomorrow. Tomorrow? You mean they stand here tonight? I already told you, Pop. They'll get ruined out in the yard. Well, if they stand here, then I'm leaving. What? That's right. I ain't staying in no house with no coffins. You mean to tell me you'd rather leave than stay in the house with these things? I would rather. <laughs> well, where are you going to sleep? I'll sleep out on the truck. On the truck? Huh? Well, Pop, the truck smells like gasoline. That don't make me no difference. I'll get a couple of blankets. You, you mean you're actually going to sleep out there on the truck? Yeah. That doesn't make any sense. All that smell of gasoline and stuff out there, Gasoline Pop. clears my sinuses. <laughs> but what about your arthritis? Now, that's bad for your arthritis. I've slept under worse conditions in the trenches. The trenches? <laughs> That's right, they had trenches at Fort Dix. <laughs> See, this is really ridiculous. You mean you're actually gonna go through with it? Pop, these are just two empty coffins. They can't hurt you. Yeah, but if I stay here tonight, you won't have to sell but one of them. <laughs> no kidding, when I was a kid, I heard a story once. A fella stayed in the house all night with a coffin, and the next morning his hair had turned white. Now, you'd look good with white hair. <laughs> just like Jackie Robinson. <laughs> Pop, that doesn't make any sense. These things can't hurt you. What are you afraid of? I ain't afraid of nothing. Ain't nothing gonna hurt me. I'm just gonna get me some sleep. Well, listen, I'll leave the door open for you in case you change your mind. You can show you can close it. I, I ain't gonna change my mind. Good night, Jackie. <laughs> just, just get it to. Doesn't make any sense. It's ridiculous. It's too cold. I'm not afraid. I stand here. Don't bother me. Can you hear me? What? I just wanted to know if you was all right and to tell you that I left the door open for you in case you change your mind. I know. Okay. I know. Just close the door. Leave I, me alone. I don't want you to be scared out there. Oh. This is ridiculous. Two empty coffins. I'm going to bed. I just wanted to tell you that the lights don't work. Why well, you come out here trying to kill me, bro? <laughs> Go in there and put a fuse in. Yeah, oh. that's what I'll do. I'll change the fuse. It probably just needs a fuse. Yeah. Go, Will. I'll just go change it. Please change it. The fuse. Oh, good night. Night. Say, Pop, where's the fuses? Where are you expecting to be? In the fruit bowl? 